Today, we're diving deep into the world of foldable phones with the hottest rumors surrounding the upcoming Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6. Buckle up, because things are about to get interesting. The rumor mill is churning out some juicy details and the latest leak comes from my smart price. They snagged a Geekbench listing for the unlocked US version of the Z Fold 6, revealing some impressive specs. Here's the breakdown. Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 chip is the top of the line processor, promising blazing fast performance for everything you throw at it. The latest Android 14 version will ensure a smooth and optimized user experience. With 12 gigabytes of RAM, you can multitasking like a champ. Z Fold 6 says no problem. But the real kicker is the benchmark scores. This new listing boasts a single core score of 2,257 and a multi-core score of 6,293. Now compare that to the Z Fold 5's average scores of 1,940 and 5,119, a significant jump. These numbers even surpass the Galaxy S24 Ultra scores, making the Z Fold 6 a potential performance leader. Leaked photos aren't the only thing keeping us on our toes. Thanks to IL, we have some official looking hands-on images of both the Z Fold 6 and its foldable sibling, the Z Flip 6. These pictures offer a clearer view of the design and that all-important crease on the main screen. Now, we've seen prototype photos before, but these new ones showcase the entire device, highlighting a boxier design and changes to the camera layout. Speaking of design, there seems to be a theme here. M Toy Google also shared prototype photos from Sony Dixon, giving us a glimpse of both the inner and outer screens. One thing's for sure, the crease is still noticeable. However, it's important to remember these are prototypes and the final version might have a less prominent crease. Samsung might be using older displays just to demonstrate the overall size and shape. Here's hoping the final product offers a smoother, more seamless viewing experience when unfolded. The prototypes also sport a black finish with a rather large and possibly stamped Samsung logo on the hinges. While some prefer the engraved logo for a touch of luxury, a stamped logo might be what we get. Another detail to pick up on is the hinge protection plate on the Z Fold 6. It appears to stick out slightly on the top and bottom. It's hard to say for sure due to lighting, but the hinge itself might sit a little farther from the main body compared to the center section. Overall, the design seems like a subtle evolution. Thinner bezels around the inner screen and a slightly sleeker look compared to last year's model are the most noticeable changes. This approach might not scream innovation, but it does offer a familiar and recognizable design language for Samsung's foldable lineup. Remember, these leafs and photos are just a peek into the development process. The final Z Fold 6 might see significant changes before hitting store shelves. We can expect wider displays, sharper corners, and possibly a lighter build with a titanium frame. So are you excited about the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6? Do the lead specs and design changes live up to the hype? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech news and updates. Today, we are diving into the latest buzz surrounding the upcoming Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. Buckle up, because this phone is shaping up to be a true game changer in the world of smartphones. Let's get into the juicy details. First off, Samsung seems laser focused on making the S25 Ultra the king of smartphones in 2025. The company appears to be using a two-pronged attack to achieve this, a monstrous camera system and mind-blowing performance upgrades. Let's start with the camera. The Galaxy S25 Ultra is expected to stick with its familiar quad camera setup, but with some serious enhancements. The main sensor will likely boast a hopping 200 megapixels, matching the S24 Ultra but optimized for the S25 Ultra's specific hardware thanks to the new Snapdragon Agent 4 camera ISP. But that's not all. We're also looking at a 5x optical zoom lens with a 50 megapixel sensor, a brand new 3x optical zoom lens, also with a 50 megapixel sensor, and an ultra wide angle lens getting a bump to 50 megapixels as well. These upgrades, particularly for the 3x zoom and ultra-wide sensors, are long overdue and promise to significantly elevate mobile photography. Now let's talk about performance. One of the most exciting rumors is the reintroduction of a fan-favorite feature, a 16GB RAM option. And not just any RAM, but the industry-first LPDDR5X RAM, capable of speeds up to a staggering 10.7 GEPs. This translates to unparalleled performance for on-device AI, demanding tasks like cloud gaming, and much more. When you combine this insane RAM with the power of the Snapdragon Agent 4 processor, the S25 Ultra has the potential to be the absolute performance leader in the smartphone world. Speaking of the Agent 4, another reliable leak suggests it'll house the most powerful GPU ever seen in a smartphone. Benchmarks show prototypes running Genshin Impact at a smooth 1080 resolution and 60 FPS. A dream for mobile gamers. 
Currently, this popular game is capped at 720 on most phones and maintaining a consistent 60 FPS is a struggle. Of course, with great power comes a potentially higher price tag. Rumors suggest the Snapdragon Agent 4 chip could inflate the price of the entire S25 series compared to its predecessor. Qualcomm has reportedly increased the cost of the Agent 4 significantly compared to the Agent 3. This leaves Samsung with a tough choice, raise prices across the board or potentially use the Exynos 2500 processor for the S25 and S25 Plus, reserving the mighty Agent 4 exclusively for the S25 Ultra. The Agent 4 itself is a whole new beast, built from the ground up using Qualcomm's Super Orion cores previously seen in their laptops this chip has the potential to give the Galaxy S25 Ultra performance that rivals some Apple M-series laptops. But wait, there's more. We also have hot rumors about the Galaxy S25 Ultra being equipped with the next generation of storage, UFS 4.1. Universal Flash Storage, or UFS, determines how fast your phone can access and store data. The latest and greatest version is UFS 4.0, which powers many current flagships, including the Galaxy S24. But the future is calling and whispers suggest the Galaxy S25 Ultra might be the first to sport UFS 4.1. While UFS 5.0 is expected around 2027, UFS 4.1 steps in as a minor yet significant upgrade. It's not a mind-blowing jump in raw numbers, but it's targeted to enhance specific areas like on-device AI features. Faster read and write speeds with UFS 4.1 will allow the phone to access data needed by AI algorithms much quicker, translating to smoother performance for features like scene optimization in your camera app, real-time language translation, and other background AI functions. So what does this all mean? The Galaxy S25 Ultra, if equipped with UFX 4.1, is shaping up to be a powerhouse for AI enthusiasts. Faster data access, improved multitasking, and potential battery life improvements. That's a recipe for a future-proof phone ready to tackle demanding tasks. Of course, this is all based on rumors for now, but one thing's for sure, the future of smartphones looks increasingly intertwined with the power of AI, and the Galaxy S25 Ultra, with its potential UFS 4.1 upgrade, might just be at the forefront of that exciting evolution. So there you have it! What are your thoughts on the upcoming S25 Ultra? Are the camera upgrades exciting you? Can't wait for the return of 16GB RAM? Or is the potential power of the Snapdragon Agent 4 blowing your mind? Let me know in the comments below! Thanks for tuning in! I will see you in the next one, guys. Until then, goodbye.